On their wedding night, they were very sweet. But the wife suddenly said that she had been bullied by her father many times. If the husband really loved her, he should kill her father. The man was furious. Does this old man really deserve to be a father? So he decided to go to his father-in-law to find out. But the moment he opened the door, he seems to be a bit scared. His daughter's husband came to visit. The old man politely invited him in. The man secretly locked the door behind him. Under the warm welcome of his mother-in-law, he could only hide the murder weapon first. But the problem arose. As soon as the man sat her down, the hammer fell out from the back. As a criminal police officers, his father-in-law immediately sensed that something was wrong. Now the man is nervous and stammering. His father-in-law had already guessed the purpose of his visit. Wait for me. The man felt bad. He turned around and tried to run away. But it was too late. He took a gun and pointed it at him. He said, some things happen, but it's better if your mother-in-law doesn't know. The mother-in-law wants to open the door to ask what's going on. But he got nervous and fired a shot. But the shot hit the sofa. The money was flying all over the place. Looks like he's an embezzler. Then they got into a fight. The old man is a police officer's. The men were no match for him. In his father-in-law's opinion, he was just looking for trouble. He kicked the man and sent him flying. Then he picked up a 300 kilograms TV and smashed it. The TV was destroyed. When the man woke up again, he was locked in the toilet. He stood up and took a look. His father-in-law and his wife were packing up the money. So he tried to find something to unlock the handcuffs. He found his mother-in-law's hairpan. But it was too far away to reach. He hooked it with his foot, but the hairpan fell further away. So he tries to knock down the shelf next to him, and a little hairpan fell from it. He was really lucky, but here's the problem. It fell down the drain. To pick it up, he'd have to use his tongue. He lay on the ground for a while and decided to hook it out with his tongue. Eventually, he managed to get the little hairpan, but there was another problem. Just as he was about to open the handcuffs, his old man came in. At this moment, he stupidly kicked his father-in-law with his leg and it punched him in the face. Then the man's head was smashed against the iron bars. But the man was so stubborn that he spat at his father-in-law. That really pissed off his father-in-law. He brought a small electric drill. He drilled the man's leg. The man was in agony. Blood splattered all over his face. The old man was tired, so he ate a sausage to refresh himself. The man wakes up again. He's come up with another way to get out of the handcuffs. He puts shower gel on his hands first. It hurts to look at it. He broke his fingers back in one go. Then he went out and grabbed his gun and aimed it at his father-in-law. But his mother-in-law got in the way. The old man tried to explain. He said he never assaulted his daughter. Then he called his daughter to confirm it. The daughter said there was no such thing. She didn't ask her husband to take revenge. The man was totally confused. So his father-in-law took a gun and strangled him with his arm. Then he got his longtime partner to help him dispose of the body. The two of them dropped the man when they were lifting him. The man woke up. When the old man saw it, he rushed to make up for it. The partner tried to bring him back to life to prevent the situation from getting worse. But the man told him about his husband's embezzlement. Originally, they embezzled the money together. But the old man took the money alone. The two men confronted each other with guns. The man just stood by and watched. But then his daughter arrived. As soon as he entered the house, the two men shot each other. But the old man was not hit by the bullet. He asked his daughter what was going on and why she let the man kill him. Under the father's pressure, the daughter told the truth because she saw the money her father had embezzled. And she wanted some money. Her father wouldn't give her any. She wanted her husband to kill him so she could get the money. Mother couldn't take it anymore. How could this family be like this? So she went inside. The father sat her day down and talked to them. He said to the daughter, I'll give you the money. You're my daughter no matter what. But this man must die. The daughter nodded her head and agreed with the father. Then the father told the daughter to go to her mother. He was going to dispose of the man, but the mother had already hanged herself. The father rushed in and cut the rope, but the mother hit her head when she fell and died instantly. The man tried to escape, but he was caught by his father-in-law. Then the daughter stabbed him again. Since he's a cop, he's experienced in handling crime scenes. He wanted to blame the man for everything, but the daughter saw him dragging her mother's body around. She felt that he didn't care about her death at all. Then the daughter shot the father. Now she'll get the money. But just then, the father wasn't dead. So he shot the daughter. All three members of the family died. In fact, the man has been used all along, but he's really lucky he didn't get killed. He found the key, unlocked the handcuffs, and left with nothing. <laughs>